today's dinner. I'm cooking from the River Cottage Much More Veg book again. And I'm gonna be cooking the roast sweet potatoes with guacamole. So hopefully it will look something like this. This is quite a simple meal. Um, again, quite simple ingredients. We've got um, sweet potatoes, some lime juice, some coriander, spring onions, three avocados, some plum little baby tomatoes, and I've got some rapeseed oil and some salt, some salt just to put on the roast potatoes, and the oil to make the guacamole with and to put over the potatoes while they're roasting. So the first thing I'm gonna do is peel these two potatoes, sweet potatoes, and then chop them into um, slices. I'll put the oven on to heat up, so it's on 180 degrees C. And that will warm up while I'm, I'm doing this. So I've peeled the potatoes, I'm just gonna slice them into slices about five to eight millimeters thick. I'm now going to put some oil over the potatoes and some salt just so they roast and crisp nicely so just a really little bit of salt and then just make sure they're all mixed in so I'm just going to push them around and then lay them all out nice and flat so they get they get evenly cooked and then that can go in the oven for half an hour before I turn them so they're cooked on both sides while the potatoes are roasting, I'm going to cut the tomatoes into quarters and put them into a bowl. Next thing to go in is the spring onions. So I'm going to take the tops and bottoms off and thinly slice them. Next, I'm going to chop up the coriander. I'm going to save a little bit for putting on the top when the meal is ready to serve um, and the rest is going to go in this guacamole bowl. And the next bit is some lime juice so I'm just going to put about half a um, lime of juice in and then I'm going to mix it all up. sweet potatoes are almost finished roasting so I'm going to prep the avocados now so I'm going to take the skins off take the um, pit out the stone and then chop them all up and they will be sort of mushed up into the rest of the guacamole mix so I've peeled all the avocados I'm just going to about to cut them up into little slices and then I can mash them in there's all the avocado, tomatoes, coriander and spring onions all mixed up, ready to go. So the potatoes have got 10 minutes left, so once they're done, I'll put them out on some plates and put the guacamole on the top. The potato is out of the oven now and ready to go. So I'm gonna dish that up and put the guacamole on top. There's the finished meal. So I've put the guacamole on top and some coriander right on the top just to look pretty, yeah, it looks really nice.